Hello, this is Mr. Nice. Um, today we will be looking at savings again. In the, my last video I talked about save as you earn. That is how to create a saving plan whereby you create the category you like, either micro, basic, or mega. Micro is 20, basic is 50, mega is 100. So today we are still on the saving plan. We talk about the first one, save as you transact. Now we are on the second one, flexible savings. Then what are flexible savings? Flexible savings is designed to help you set aside a fund for emergencies, save toward a specific goal or simply build up a discipline of savings. Where, as we can see the percentage, that's uh the percent that money plan will allocate to you is nine percent per annum that's in a year so let's choose a plan on the flexible savings this is what they are saying uh we already know the percentage nine per annum that is amount of the amount of your money you saved per annum they will give you interest of nine so saving duration, minimum of one month, no maximum. Minimum of one month, no maximum. You can be able to save minimum of one month, no maximum. Saving top up anytime. You can top up the saving anytime you like. Withdrawal is instant, but interest won't be paid after for withdrawal in the month. If you put the money, you withdraw something from the money and you withdraw, you withdraw, you withdraw. Interest will not be paid. They just want you to leave the money there. Halal complaint. You can option out receiving interest on your savings. Um, this is because of religion aspect. Some religion do not allow a believer of that religion to have um, interest on his or her capital so you can option out if that is not your problem you can option the interest as if you received if i click on start savings now say the first one says set your flexible plan right saving plan provide the required information what are you saving toward? I have a target. If you say you have a target, it has different field of information. No, I am just savings. It's already the plan name, starting date. You choose saving frequency. That's the duration and the amount. So now let's go with I have a target. If I choose on plan name, Let's say buying a car, right? Target date, right? Let me just say 25 April, right? Um, I'm coming. Target date, yes, 25 April, starting date. Let me just say today is six months, right? That's to, for it to start today. How much are you aiming for? Let me just put 1 million, right? So, how often do you want to save? That is, I want it daily, right? If I say save right then you see suggested per day is 20,000 is a suggestion that they bring you have to save 20,000 for you to get your target that 1 million that you set if you are doing it up to fourth um 25th April from 6 March so you have to save 20,000. Let me check 
let me change the date my date for my target let me make it 25 me you see the target will change it's 12,500 so you have to save daily if I click on next that is how I can able to save for this saving plan so this is how to save I have a target if I come back nothing I'm just I am just savings so that is the information still you will fill up let me clear this no need for me to select so you just fill up the information and click on next so basically this is flexible savings you choose the date that you start the saving and the target you have if you don't have the target you just put in nothing I just I'm just savings so it is Mr. Nice. Thank you for your time.